The real dream is I want to be able someday to take off my shirt and feel proud of my body, not proud of my body as, oh boy, he's pretty good for a 72-year-old guy. No, just proud of my body. Wow, look at that body. That's what I want. I've always wanted it, never had it. And if I don't do it now, what am I going to do when I'm 86? <laughs> That'll be a real isogenics video. I've just begun my uh, isobody challenge, and I thought it would be a good idea for me to show everybody what I, the state that I'm in right now, so that hopefully if my dreams come true and I realize maybe, you know, this great physical shape that I'm dreaming of, that uh, we'll be able to show the difference. Okay, so basically what I did was I looked at the before shoot, the before footage that we shot on Memorial Day, and we're going to parallel each thing that we did on Memorial Day here on Labor Day so we can show the difference of the shape that I've been able to achieve. Maybe I haven't achieved my full dream, but that'll be for my next challenge. So, you obviously, like every person on the planet, I used to fly out of the, open the door like I just did and fly out of the car. Now, my getting out of the car is like a, a, a multi-step procedure. First, I put this leg out. Then I brace myself here and here. And I, and I get the my right leg braced and my left leg braced and I push as hard as I can and I, and I don't do it too fast because I don't want to pull something and then, and then and I'm out of breath. I remember in the Memorial Day shoot, we had me getting out of the car as a demonstration for how I moved just in general as an old person kind of hunched over a little bit and kind of walking slow and creaky and all that stuff has disappeared. I'm getting it, it's just so much, everything's easier. You know, I just hop in, I hop out, you know, it's like, I'm a new man. That's all I can say. This is the machine that I used to use back in the day. I got up to about 19. Right now what you're seeing, me trying to get up, is the problem. I'm get up like an old man. When I used to just pop out of this thing, I've got to, I've got to get everything just right. So right now, we're going to do the part of the leg stretching machine. I am so much more flexible now than I was three or four months ago. So let's see what, what we can get it to. So right now, what? I can't believe it. It's 38. David, you're going to have to hold the camera with it to prove this. I just got it up to 38. I'm glad that we caught live on camera a personal milestone in my life that my previous achievement was in my 30s and now I just surpassed that in my 70s. <coughs> oh, well, that's about, that's about the best I can do. Before, everything was a huge effort. Now I should just be able to go into it. Okay, so that right off the bat is a big improvement. It's balancing, which is much harder. And Yeah, I got it. Hmm, I can even stay there. Not bad. So here we go. It's like a rock. We have no before shots of this activity at all. And the reason is there wouldn't have been a prayer that I could have even gotten myself up onto the chinning bar part of this to start with, let alone do sit-ups. That's one. Okay, one, two, three, I feel like I could do a lot, but this is, you got to shorten the clip a little bit. End of the challenge body. Now, is it the best body in the world? No. But is it great compared to what I was? Hell yes. She goes. He looks better than me. <laughs> she said it like this. He looks better than me. Actually, I did say it like that. <laughs> <laughs>